Hello gamers and welcome back to the British content channel. Today's video is going to be a pro tier build. I think this build is perfect for the new Lua survivals. Um, it literally just handles everything for hours when solo. I think it's better than a core and necro setup but whatever you do you. Um, I've done solo like two hours with this and it, it handles everything perfectly fine. It is going to be a blazing artillery related build, so pretty much standing one area and press a few buttons and GG, because that is how I like to play the game. So let's go and take a look at the build. Alright, so here's the setup I've been using for the new Lua Survival. Here's the pro tier build. We are running an Archon Vitality blazing artillery related setup. So we have pretty decent duration, so we don't have to press the button like constantly. Uh, and pretty decent strength for two reasons. We have more damage on this thing, and we have armor strip with Stein Axe's ability. So, Prime Sure Footed, I mean, you know, why not? Growing power for that extra strength, and then the rest of this stuff is just sort of like range, duration, you know, that stuff. Arcane Energize pairs really well with Dispensary, so you'll never ever run out of energy. And Molt Augmented is just one for the extra strength and two for the armor strip. So Steinax's ability, I'm using that because the Thrax units spawn kind of like in a group. And if you armor strip all of them at once, you can just one shot all of them with the Glaive or the Latum or something like that. So that's why I'm using that. Now we use the shield fans uh, to keep you shield gating basically all the time. But you'll never really need to shield gate with this anyway because everything just dies. So yeah. Uh, obviously, again, same thing. Glaive build, Leighton build, Phylox build. And I'm using Madurai just because it's easier to kill the Ghost Thrax units when they're a really high level with Madurai. But you can use whatever you want. So yeah, let's go into a mission and I'll show you how to use it now. Okay, so we're here on the Lua Survival. This is the perfect starting room. We're going to be camping on top of this thing. And it's pretty much just easy peasy. So let's start it and then I'll show you. Alright, so as soon as you start, dispensary, shield fans, kill a couple of enemies while you wait for some energy to pop out, and then blazing artillery. And now, you're basically in the setup forever, you just keep pressing 2 whenever it runs out, and that's it. Okay, so once you get to the point where the sentients are about to spawn, all you have to do is use Steinax and Gelatum, and it's it's that simple. GG. As long as you keep your turret up, nothing will come from the front, and it's that simple, really. Obviously, the shield fans are keeping me alive basically forever, and uh, yeah, it's that simple. So like, there's an Eximus unit. As soon as the turrets target him, it's just he's just gonna die. And now we have the thingy majiggy, whatever he's called. There you go. <laughs> well done. And all of that, I was magnetized and I'm still alive, so... Alright, yeah, so there's the build. I mean, I would test it at like 60 minutes or something, but I can't be bothered to play this game for an hour. So yeah, hopefully someone uses Protea now, because Protea is cool. Thanks. Like, sub. Goodbye, people. See you again in another four years.